Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks yet again, and today we are checking out an awesome creation right here that is an ornithopter. Now, if you guys don't know what that is, uh, essentially it is something that flaps its wings to fly, I believe. <laughs> something like that anyway. Uh, so essentially this thing grabs these things and flaps them around in order to actually take off and fly around. Apparently it flies like a plane and also a helicopter. Whatever that means. Anyway, let's go ahead and get inside this thing and see what we can actually do with it and uh, get going. So, I don't know how we actually enter. Here we go, push button, okay, and the seat drops down. There we go, nice. Once we're in the seat, does it go back up? There we go. Okay, so I haven't actually played with this thing just yet, so um, you guys are seeing my, uh, my first experience with it. Uh, we're going to go ahead and turn on these guys. Uh, we're going to go ahead and turn on the battery, wherever that is. Uh, engine bus, yes. Oh my. Reactor switch, MES, yeah, sure. Uh, is there a battery? Is there actually a battery switch? I feel like it's all on. Gyro is gonna go on, there we go, awesome. And, um, engine start, let's go. Is that working? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Cockpit lights I've gone ahead and turned on, okay, excellent. Thrust spoiler, throttle. Okay, so how do I actually take off with this thing? Two is blades. There we go, they've actually extended out sideways. How do I fly? How do I actually fly? I don't know. Engine start, does it work now? Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, this is cool. This is very cool. Okay, so the engine is starting. Yes, I'm gonna go ahead and press six for the uh, navigation lights. Five for the strobe lights. Let's go. Okay, try and take off. Is this, is this gonna work? I don't know. Throttle it up. I don't know if I can take off like this. I think it's trying. It's definitely trying. Oh boy, here we go. Are you ready? Oh, this is strange. There we go, we're in the sky. <laughs> this is so weird. Okay, landing gear, I'm gonna actually bring up straight away. So that, so that we can get out, there we go. And we are flying purely by flapping our wings. How interesting is that? <laughs> it's so weird. It is so, so weird. Anyway, this thing is a recon reconnaissance aircraft. So, um, oh my, that's going crazy. Oh, this is all going a bit crazy. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and do this. And hopefully fly forwards. There we go. And hopefully that stops this from happening. Nope. <laughs> it's just going to continue to happen anyway. But look at it go. This thing is amazing. It's like a dragonfly. Are they called dragonflies? What are they called? They are called dragonflies, right? They're things that hover above the water and they're quite long. I don't know. Anyway, can I change this? We have an, a horizontal uh, artificial horizon. What is this? Add. What does that do? I don't know what that does. I'm, I'm going to ignore that. Here's our little camera uh, that presumably we can point around by doing this. Yeah, okay, that is actually working. Uh, and that is our reconnaissance bit. That's kind of sick. That's actually really awesome. Uh, okay, so we're flying. I don't know where we're gonna go. I don't know what we're gonna do with this thing I figured we'd just do a quick video checking it out. Okay, so now we're flying Where can we actually land something like this? Its wings are so long. I would imagine it's actually pretty difficult to land um, But I, I mean I could be wrong. I could be completely wrong. What do we have in here? We have a cable, okay, and we have a fire extinguisher. Hopefully we don't need either of those is there anything behind me? There is nothing behind me. So it is purely a one-person aircraft, even though it is this big. It's huge. It is ginormous. Also, if you guys haven't noticed already, the glass is, like, painted. How cool is that? It's, like, tinted. It doesn't look like that from the inside, though. Interesting. Uh, right, okay. I want to fly over to this island over here and actually attempt to land. So let's turn to our left. Here we go. And figure out if we can actually land this thing. We're going to thrust spoiler all the way down. There we go. Landing gear was three. Yeah, there it is. Uh, we're going to attempt to land this thing. Okay. I don't know how this is going to go. <laughs> I don't know how this is going to go. But let's see if we can do it. Also, is there any missions that are currently accessible? There is a mission, but it's in the middle. Oh. A dumper truck radioed for help. I'm not going to go. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I'm not going to save the guy that's that's a dumper truck, but that's okay. So, let's get ourselves over here, try and land on the helipad. Is there a... 
I can't see. Is there a tree next to the helipad? I, I seem to remember there was. But no, I think we're good. I think we're okay. So, we're going to continue forwards anyway. We're going to land at the hospital. We're going to show the doctors uh, our ornithopter. Yeah. All right, here we go. So, we're over here. Let's go ahead and start descending. Oh, this thing is insane. It is actually madness. Okay, I don't want to land there. I want to land on the actual helipad. Okay, and land. Here we go. Landed. Excellent. How do I turn this thing off? <laughs> I don't know. Engine start. No, engine bus. Okay, there we go. We've turned everything off right there. Thrust spoiler is seemingly still on, but that's okay. Okay, push button allows us to go out the bottom. And there we go. Let's go ahead and close it up. Nicely done. That's sick. That is actually really cool. There is one thing that I do want to test with it, though, is if it can actually lift things up. You know, I think that's quite a cool test to do with this. So, how about we go spawn something in, and we attempt to lift it. Let's do that. Alright, back inside we go. Here we go. Inside the seats. Go ahead and get ascended. There we go. Do this, this, this. Engine start. Okay. Oh, it is actually hitting the floor on the left there. Hopefully that's not too bad. It looks like it doesn't worry about that too much. Alright, it's away. There we go. Fantastic. And we're going to head back to... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> we're going to go head back to the airport so that we can actually try and lift something up. Let's go. Oh, this thing's amazing. It's actually really, really cool. I've got an idea, actually. Let's head left. We'll go to the North Harbor and... We'll try and lift up a train, question mark? We'll try and lift up a steam locomotive. That seems like a fun idea. Let's get ourselves over there. And attempt to lift one up. Yeah, what is this? Cam frequency. Oh, interesting. I can actually transmit. Oh, look at that. Look at a news crew. That's fantastic. Okay, we're over here. We need to stop and slow down and stuff. So do this. Landing gear down. And we're going to go descend over there. Hopefully not hitting our blades off anything. That would be really bad. Uh-oh. Uh oh I was just falling out the sky a little bit there, but it's okay. Keep moving forwards. Here we go. Yes. Uh, and we're going to have to use a cable to do this. But that's okay, because cables are strong. Cables are strong. Okay, here we go. Descend, hopefully, sort of <laughs> nicely. Because if we descend not nicely, I don't know what I'm going to do. Here we go. Okay, turn these off. And we've landed. Good. Descend out of here. And there we go. That's cool. That's very cool. Anyway, I need to load up a mission. I need to load up an actual mission. Here we go. And we need to find our train. Uh, which we don't actually... Oh, there it is. Our train is right here. I don't know whether it has any cable anchors on it. I want to go with it doesn't. So we're going to quickly modify our train. You guys are going to do it with me. Oh, I have to purchase the property? Interesting. Here we go. So, load up our train, wherever it is. Come on, there it is. Uh, attach a connector to it. Connector. Uh, it's not actually a connector, is it? It's an anchor. Here we go. Uh, cable anchor, yes. Go ahead and smash that on there. Okay. Save it as... There we go. Excellent. Okay. Modify this one to actually be our new one. Here we go. Sorry, it's being a little bit slow, but that's okay. And then spawn it in. Uh, don't worry about that. That's fine. That's okay to be there. Uh, but here it is. So, we're going to try and connect this to there uh, with our cable, which is just up here. So, connect this. Hopefully, we can connect the top bit of this. I'm assuming. Assuming we can. Um... Might be easier to do it the other way around, actually. So, run up here. There we go. On top of the train, grab this guy. It's a fluid one? What have I done? Okay, hang on. We need to redo this. We need to redo this. I wonder how much fuel that thing actually has. Also, I don't know how I managed to do this, but sure, it's fine. So, connect that one to there. Save it as... Do -a -do -a -do -a -c, 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 c Go ahead and put it in as the new mission. Here we go. Okay, replace. Yes. With this one. Yes. Go. Alright. Who thinks uh, that this is actually going to lift this? Uh, let me know in the comments down below, because I genuinely don't know. Um, I, I have no idea, but we'll see. 
Yeah, <laughs> we will see indeed. Alright, let's run to the front of this. Yep, yeah, cable's coming with me. We're going to jump up here. We're going to crouch underneath here and connect on to... Oh, I fell off. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, we're going to have to do it without. There we go. Alright, do it the other way around. I think it's going to be able to lift it, to be honest, but I think it might have some issues. Balancing is definitely going to be one of those, because the connection point's at the front, not underneath the actual lifting power. So this is going to be kind of interesting to see what happens. Anyway, let's go inside. Turn all of this on. Engine start. Here we go. Gyro's already on. Alright, everybody ready for this? I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know. It starts up quite quickly once it's, once it's been done, though. So that's good. Anyway, let's go ahead and lift ourselves into the sky. There we go. We're doing it. Can we lift a steam locomotive up? Is the next question. Let's keep ascending. Okay. Okay. We're struggling. No, 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 no. No, it can't. It can't do it. It can't do it. Oh, yikes. Oh, yikes. Wait, actually, how do I get out of this? Uh. Um. Please let me out. It decided that it was going to do something and then it decided not to. Oh, yikes. Okay, well, I'm trapped in here. It's set on fire. Oh, I just fell out. <laughs> I just fell out. Okay, well, I mean, it's an interesting creation. Of course, it is a reconnaissance aircraft. It has got nothing to do with lifting. Uh, but I figured we'd try. Also, a military version of this would be fantastic. It'd be really, really cool. Missiles galore. That'd be amazing. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go and end this video here for now. It's just a quick video of this thing. I'll link it down below so you guys can check it out yourselves. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.